Throughout your life, you will encounter extremely challenging situations, and you might be facing some of them right now. Remember that this is a normal part of the human experience, and it happens to everyone. Unfortunately, many of us fall into the trap of believing that life should only consist of happy and enjoyable moments, creating an illusionary reality. No matter how hard we try to avoid it, there will come a time when we encounter a situation that pushes us to our limits. The bright side is that, as human beings, we have the capacity to manage our emotions to some extent and face these complicated circumstances with greater strength and resilience, minimizing suffering. However, mastering this ability is not an easy task. In this video, I'll be discussing temperance, one of the historically significant virtues. Let me share a story to illustrate its importance. Once, a king had a precious ring made with a diamond by the best goldsmiths in the region. Inside the ring, he wanted to hide a message that could offer guidance during difficult times, a message he could pass on to future generations. The challenge was to find a concise message that would fit on the small space available. Despite the wisdom of the learned sages in his court, they struggled to find such a message that could fit over the diamond. Eventually, the king's humble servant came up with a simple yet profound message that fulfilled the king's wishes. Next to the king, there was a man who had served his father and had taken care of him after his mother's passing. This man was treated like a family member and earned the respect of all in the palace. The king consulted him as well, despite the man not being a sage or scholar. The man shared that during his long stay in the palace, he had encountered various people, including a wise master who had once been a guest of the king's father. Upon the master's departure, the man had seen him off, and, as a gesture of gratitude, the master gave him a tiny piece of paper with a message. He handed over the paper to the king, who kept it folded inside the ring without reading it, as the master advised. The message was to be opened only when the king found himself in an insurmountable situation, the day of adversity came sooner than expected when the kingdom was invaded, and the king had to flee on horseback to save his life. The enemy was in hot pursuit, and he found himself at a dead end near a precipice overlooking a deep valley. There was no way forward, and returning was impossible due to the enemy's presence. He could hear their galloping horses and voices drawing closer. In that critical moment, he remembered the ring and the hidden message. With trembling hands, he opened the paper and found a powerful message. This too shall pass. The king realized that a profound silence enveloped him, and to his surprise, the enemy's pursuit had halted. They seemed to have lost their way in the forest or chosen a wrong path. The king survived the ordeal, knowing that both good and bad times are temporary. A profound silence surrounded the king, and he could no longer hear the galloping of the horses. Deeply grateful to the servant and the mysterious master, he found the words on the paper to be miraculous. After restoring his kingdom and celebrating victory with music and dance, the elder advised the king to read the message in the ring once again. Confused, the king asked why he should read it in a moment of euphoria and joy, but the elder explained that the message applied not only to desperate situations, but also to moments of pleasure and triumph. The king reread the message. This too shall pass, and experience the same sense of peace and tranquility amidst the celebratory crowd. The elder emphasized that everything in life passes, whether it be good or bad. No event or emotion is permanent, just like the changing cycles of day and night. Joy and sadness are both natural parts of life, and we should accept them as elements of the dual nature of things. Understanding this concept is essential for mastering our emotions. Acknowledging that what we feel at any given moment is temporary can help us navigate through life's ups and downs. Everyone experiences happiness and sadness at some point, as these emotions are inherent to the human experience. Nothing in life lasts permanently. Life is a mix of both positive and negative experiences, when we face moments of sadness, it is beneficial to acknowledge and understand that this feeling is temporary. Acceptance doesn't imply resignation, 
passivity or agreement with what's happening. It simply means recognizing that certain things are beyond our control. Acceptance leads us to take a proactive approach. We become aware that if we can influence or change our situation, our energy and focus should be directed towards that goal. When we accept a situation, it becomes easier to move forward without dwelling excessively on the negative aspects. Similarly, during happy times, it's essential to enjoy them, but in moderation. We should avoid becoming engulfed by euphoria and forgetting that these moments will also pass. People who forget this truth are ill-prepared to face life's difficult situations and may live in a fragile bubble that will eventually burst. Temperance, as depicted in the story, applies not only to joy and sorrow, but to any emotion. Extreme emotions are rarely positive, but when we manage our feelings with moderation, they can provide valuable lessons for our lives. According to Scenic, temperance is a virtue involving control and moderation of impulses and desires to prevent us from falling into excess or deficiency. Epictetus describes temperance as a pleasant harmony of feelings resulting from a life where desires are controlled and reason acts as a guide. Marcus Aurelius states that temperance is the virtue that enables us to govern and direct our passions and desires, avoiding extremes and maintaining a balanced and moderate life. In opinion, temperance is an essential virtue that challenges us human beings to find a balance in our emotions and actions. In the face of life's upheavals, whether positive or negative, the ability to practice temperance can make a big difference in our journey. We live in a world full of ups and downs, where we face challenges and moments of happiness. The ability to accept that these situations are fleeting and not be overwhelmed by extreme emotions is what makes temperance so valuable. By calmly accepting difficult times, we can improve our resilience and find more effective solutions to overcome them. On the other hand, temperance also prevents us from getting lost in the euphoria of victories and successes. It is essential to enjoy the happy moments, but without losing the notion that they are also temporary. Keeping our feet on the ground and acknowledging the transience of moments of joy helps us to appreciate the present more fully and prepare for future adversities.